live. What if we actually did a live? Zero viewers. I was thinking, like, what if I started doing Twitch, but, like, I did it alone, and, like, no one is there? What would I do? What do you do when you start? Like, when there's just no one there? Yeah, like, if you're just starting out. Because, I mean, you have to start somewhere. Do I still talk as if there's people there? You just play until someone shows up, and then try not to lose them. Have you ever been the only viewer in a live stream? I don't think so. Like, if you accidentally click on an Instagram live, and you're the only person there, and then they, like, greet you by name, like, oh my god, Emily, hi, thank you so much for joining. Click. And you're the only person there, so you can't leave. Welcome back to the annual baking vlog. Today we are baking some rolls. Some dinner rolls and some cookies. Yeah. We're up for a challenge today. This year I've been really into baking bread, so I want to bake some rolls for Thanksgiving, so... I'm practicing. Thanksgiving is next week. Rolls Royce. Not even next week. It's this coming week. Yeah. It's Saturday. Thanksgiving's on Thursday. Coming up fast, so I have to perfect my rolls. I bought these two Mountain Dews, seasonal Mountain Dews. Voodoo, which I guess maybe is Halloween, but it was out. And the Fruit Quake. I don't think this is going to be good. Every time I've seen it in stores, it's like fully stocked. No one wants this. But... They wouldn't make something like disgusting, I would think. So you'd think that, I'm but I'm gonna give it a try. Artificial <laughs> fruit cake flavor. I don't feel good about that, but I'm gonna try it. What's this one? I didn't listen. Voodoo mystery oh. flavor. I hope this isn't like the Halloween candy corn flavor. And also, I have some crumble cookies. Mm -hmm. Tasting this week's crumble cookies. We have apple pie. Some chocolate chunk, pumpkin cake, and lemon blackberry. So it's a bunch of just junk food day. Yeah. Junk food vlog. So I'm going to try this first just to get this out of the way. Why don't I try the other one? Okay. Oh, yeah. Carbonation. This is good. Carbonation. Smells this like... This is good. I don't know what it is. I remember one year there was a candy corn flavor, I think, and it was not good. This tastes just like lemony. I like this one. It kind of tastes like voltage, but more lemony. Um, what are your thoughts? Tastes just like, I don't know, berries of some kind. Ooh. Tastes like spicy. But yeah. not spicy hot, but spicy spices. I mean, you're used to the fizz fizzlingness of it. Yeah, I like carbonation. Okay, it's good. It is good. It tastes like Christmas. It doesn't taste like artificial fruitcake, which sounds disgusting. This actually is good. I feel like this one's not for everyone, but I think it's good. It's definitely not as gross as I was expecting it to be. It's not bad. Not Mountain as... Dew, please sponsor me. I drink Mountain Dew every day of my life. She literally. does. Speaking of. Often multiple times a day. I drink this one every single morning. Every single morning for the past like year and a half, I've had one of these for breakfast. So I have to put it in the fridge for tomorrow morning. I cannot go without it. No, she can't. Mountain Dew, please sponsor me. Okay, we have to take a dinner break soon, so we should hurry up and get the cookie dough finished before we eat because the cookie dough has to sit for two hours in the fridge. So we should probably do that first. So let's see the recipe. I've never made these before, but they're really good. They're kind of like shortbread -y. Ready? Yeah. Butter, sugar, eggs, half vanilla, Half a pound flour. of butter. Oh my god, we might not have that. It's half a half pound. Half a pound. This is one. Wait. Half a pound. Okay, okay, that's fine. That's fine. Sugar. Cane sugar. Organic cane sugar because I'm an organic girl now, except for the flour because they didn't have it. Yolks of two eggs. Just the yolks. Yolks. Organic vanilla. We love organic here. We love health. That's why we're trying Mountain Dew crumble cookies and having a bunch of fried food for dinner. Yeah, and cookie and cakes and whatever. Yeah, rolls and more cookies. We yeah. love health. Here. We're very healthy. Food coloring. Um, we don't need it, but like, yeah. Isn't this supposed to be like one of the worst things possible for you is different dyes? It's probably not. Red 40. Isn't that the one that's really, really bad? It's probably not good, but. Corn syrup and dyes. Blech. It doesn't color. even look like that, right? That's just from the... They show it look all, like, bright and, like... Yeah, you would have to put a ton to get it to be that color. You would literally, like, get poisoned and die. Is this bowl fine? I think so. It's a weird shape. So there's no... 
It is, honestly. Fall has been through some things. Like, I feel like we've had this forever. I've used it in all of our videos. Yeah. I'm not going to lie. This is like an ancient family artifact. <laughs> ancient relic. Wait, so there's there's literally no instructions. We just do the thing. Wait, what was it? Butter, flour, sugar, vanilla, two yolks? Yolks. Was there any liquid? Uh, didn't say so. That's going to be some hard dough. Maybe the butter really does need to be melted. Just the five things. I guess let's get to yolking. I don't know how to do the yolks. You did it before? I mean, like... You, you crack it in half and you go ploop, 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 ploop. And then just the yolks are left and you put the yolks in here. Remember we did this. I, I, have, I don't think I've ever done it like that. Well, we got 12 eggs, so trial and error. It's not the yellow part, just the... We want the yellow part, so keep the yellow part in the egg shell and then put it in Yeah. Here. And make sure to check for weevils. Yeah. I've been really into making bread lately, so I've been buying a lot of flour, and I did not know weevils... Oh, that's not good. I got the yolk thing, kind of, but also not. Maybe try again. I saw these little bugs in my flour... When I opened it, like I would see one bug like along the seal and I was like, oh, that's just a one-off thing. There was a bug. I just pick it off and go about my life. And then I had flowers sitting under my cabinet for a few weeks, a few months maybe. I don't know. I thought it was flower. I thought it could like last through the apocalypse. Like I thought that's what the ancient people made things with. Like it lasts forever. And I opened it and it was full of bugs. And then one of them is just so disgusting even had like little worms like little larvas in it it was so gross i was so disturbed obviously i threw it away i didn't bake with it but ever since then i've been like on high alert with my flour so make sure you check your flour before using it because weevils like to be in flour and it's really disturbing to find bugs in your food let me double check your work yeah is it illegal to have any bit of it <laughs> no i don't these cookies might not even turn out good because I've never made well, them before. I don't know what to expect. All right, we're, we're one for two. So we'll see how this next one goes. Since daylight saving, it's six o'clock and it's already pitch black. Oh! Uh-oh, gamers. Not off to a good start. I cannot see one article of sunlight. Yeah, and... it's making me really depressed and really tired, and things have just been going downhill. There's no way this is enough liquid. <laughs> Just dry. <laughs> Nothing but dry ingredients. It's literally flour. Mm. We gotta deal with the butter situation. Okay, maybe we'll eat, and then the butter will be more room temperature by then. We're back, <laughs> and... It's only been like 15 minutes, so the butter is not soft. I'm gonna microwave it. Yeah. Don't tell anyone. Okay, I won't. I'll mix this. Okay, Thanks. there's nothing to mix, but yeah. You put in two egg yolks, and it's literally just flour. Yeah, where did the yolks go? They're just gone. I'm feeling too tired for this. Yeah. I just don't have it in me. It's dark. I just ate. I had a glass of wine. We're very, Time for bed. We're really full, and our feet hurt, and yeah. we're tired. We're having a grand old time. I don't really want to do this, but <laughs> who cares anyway? We so. hate this stupid video. Just kidding. We're having fun. It's just a little tired out. Stupid cookies are gonna go right into the garbage. Can you hear this? Yeah. ASMR butter sounds. No, not doing that. I really do want to do ASMR. I want to do everything. I'm gonna have the most like eclectic channel. I want to do ASMR and gaming. Maybe a variety channel. And vlogs. <laughs> it's not melted, but it's liquid. I'm just gonna go for it. Okay, coming together. We've probably made worse things, like that pizza cake, whatever. Oh my god, stop. Remember and then we filmed it and it didn't film? <laughs> Something happened. We were like dying laughing and it didn't even film. It was so funny. So basically, we did a whole video where it was back in the time where everything was cake. Do you guys remember that cursed time on the internet where there was just so many videos of these super realistic cakes? Well, I decided I wanted to make one, so I tried to make a cake that looked like a pizza. And we filmed it, and it was really bad, but it was really funny, and the footage didn't save, so you'll never see it. We filmed a lot of videos that never get posted. This is not dough. This is crumbly. What are you doing? 
Just like an extra drop. Okay. Wait, is this all the ingredients? That's all it said. We're calling in the backups. The reinforcements have arrived. I'm not sure. I know it's supposed to go like this. I don't know if it's supposed to click or turn or... It is supposed to turn. So it goes in like that, but I don't know how to keep it. Like that. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. She's so crazy. I'm so quirky and funny. Have you seen that meme with the lady with the pizza rolls on her head where she's like, ah, she's so crazy. It's probably TikTok, so no. No, it's not TikTok. Might as well be. No, it's not. It's an old classic. Jeez. I'm going to try a crumble since these cookies are not coming along. <laughs> We're just going to end up buying cookies by the end of this. I already did. <laughs> yeah, more. Uh, let me dry this. Ah. I don't know what just happened. Looks clean. Oh my god. Looks clean, doesn't it? This pumpkin cake crumble is really, really, really good. But it's doing something crazy to my mouth that I can't even explain. You know, people always complain about crumble. I see so much crumble hate online. People are like, oh my god, it's so expensive. Five dollars for one cookie. That does not look right. <laughs> this is not dope. It's just shards. But like five dollars is not that much for a huge cookie. That's a huge cookie. Is it per cookie? I think so. I don't know. It was like $13 for this box of four. But the cookies are huge. But everything's expensive, so, like, honestly, so. Yeah, I don't know. I didn't find them to be, like, obscenely expensive. Turn this dust into dough. Sounds dry. <laughs> we figured it out all by ourselves. Sounds like sand. Yeah. Oh, it's dough now. Look at that. Oh. See? <laughs> What are we worried about? Maybe that. I'm making it worse. <laughs> anyway, this crumble is very, very, very good. Should I expose what happened to you and crumble? Yeah. I still have beef about that, honestly. Tell the story. Let's see if you remember. <laughs> uh, so she was at the place, and she put a order in, and they, like, helped everyone before her, and it took, like, 45 minutes, mm -hmm. and she didn't, she didn't like it. <laughs> That's about as much as they got. I don't know. The way you describe it makes it seem like I was being ridiculous. Well, 45 minutes or however long is pretty unridiculous. unridiculous. Anyway, I went to Crumble. And I ordered on the app before I got there. And when I got there, it was super, super busy. There were like a bunch of people in the store. I was waiting. I did the whole thing where it's like tap to say you're here. Like it would tell you what place in line you are. And I was like ninth place in line or whatever. But people who were coming in after me and placing their orders in the store were getting their orders before me. And I was sitting in there for at least 45 minutes, if not an hour. And they asked me even, they're like, oh, what are you waiting on? Because I, they noticed I was there for so long. And I said, I ordered a four pack. And then it, like more time went by and I was never helped. And everyone who was in the store at the same time as me had already come in and out. So I had to walk out and just leave because I had been waiting at Crumble for an hour. I had things to do. So I lost $17 because they forced you to tip in the app. And it's like, I'm pretty patient with like food workers and stuff, but like an hour and everyone else is being helped but me? That's not cool. So I will not return to the Parma Crumble, just so we all know. If you're watching this, don't go to Parma Crumble. Strongsville Crumble is okay though. They're good. I'm excited to make rolls. Having a lot of sugar today. I need shape, some good old bread. Shape into rolls, semicolon. Refrigerate until ready to bake at least two hours. Should it be big? Yeah. I have a song stuck in my head and I don't know what it is. And it's not a good one. Who's excited for Spotify Wrapped? Way way I do my playlist Me. is I have like I have like different sections. So like every like two or three weeks, I just, I add like five, six, seven songs until I'm bored with those. And then I add five, six, seven more. I have all the songs I listen to in one big playlist and I never change it. I just add songs to it, but I don't find songs that I like very often. So I've been listening to the same like hundred songs for the past four years. Yeah, she does too. I do. I, I don't know. It's hard for me to find music I like. I'm fussy. So everyone should suggest me some music. Even yeah. if it's bad, I won't judge. I'll judge, though. 
Don't don't send us bad music. Yeah. What what are you really thinking? What are you doing? Why would you do that? What? Why would you even think of doing that? Well, no, it said shape into rolls, right? Yeah, two rolls. Okay. How, do, how exactly? <laughs> two Play-Doh-y. It looks like a... I don't know. Not good, that's for sure. Like a big turd. I don't know. I feel like I shouldn't be manhandling it like this. I dreamed I was in high school, as I usually do. And they had Bosco sticks. Which are my favorite food. Bosco sticks? Yeah. What a wonderful surprise. I know. I was so happy. I bought like a bunch of them. But what is a Bosco stick? It's like a bread stick that looks like this and it has a bunch of cheese in it. That's what I thought it was. I remember in elementary school they had like the cinna, cinna, cinna sticks, the cinnamon sticks. Hmm. I don't forget what, like churros, I think. Churros? Yeah. I like churros, I think. School lunch is really bad at our school. One of my friends apparently found, like, a piece of metal in this food. Oh, my God. <laughs> I, it was, like, very small. But that I'm, doesn't matter. But I remember, it's still not good. I remember you was like, should I tell someone about this? Yeah, we you all, should. We were all like, maybe. I don't know if he did, but maybe you should have. That's kind of alarming. Why is this like this? I don't know. Why? I didn't is do that. Is that so hard? <laughs> What's that mean? Up next, another brown bowl. We are making dinner rolls next. Earlier this year, I saw this TikTok of this girl just eating a tray of dinner rolls, and I was so inspired. And I did make them earlier this year, and they turned out really, really bad. They were, like, okay when they were fresh out of the oven, but they were, like, really, really dense and bready. They were just not – they weren't right. But I've been practicing my bread, and I'm really good at making bread now, so I feel like I can do it. She's brought over, you brought over the bread things before, and they were pretty good. So, whoop. And if all else oh. fails, I got bread right here. This is where I went wrong the first time. The yeast has to be mixed with liquid from 100 to 110 degrees. Otherwise, it won't activate or it will burn. So that's why the milk has to be that temperature. Tablespoon? I wasn't paying attention. Wait, what did I need a tablespoon of? Wait, look at the recipe. What? Look oh. at how much yeast. <laughs> Sorry. Also, oh my why God, is... the recipe's right on the computer. Oh, for the rolls? Oh. Oh, okay. One cup of whole milk. Warm to about 110 Fahrenheit. How much yeast? I'm getting there. Two and 2.25 teaspoons platinum yeast. 2.25 teaspoons? Hold on, hold on. Hold Red on. Star Instant Yeast. Oh, jeez. Wait, is that what I have? That is not what I have. That'll be fine. I, th I don't think it matters. Two tablespoons granulated sugar. Two tablespoons? Yep. Wait. Teaspoon. Why do they call it teaspoon? Because it's like a teaspoon. Hope that helps. What? How much yeast? The spoon... <laughs> Two and a fourth? The spoon developed from England's love of drinking tea as well as England's colonial sugar wealth. And a tablespoon is because it's the spoons that you put on the table for dinner. Is it? Yeah. How much yeast... 1760 is the ideal spoon. <laughs> two, I told you like 20,000 times. Two, two and, one, and a fourth? Two and one fourth. Okay, so one half, one. One and one, one and one. One and one half. Mm -hmm. two. two. Nothing sounds grosser than a nice cup of warm milk. Okay, we're at 108 degrees. No one else cares except for me. What? I thought I was watching something. This is a big whisk. Do we have a small whisk? I, I checked the top the top one. I think I just put one in there. This is the top one. No, the top the topper one. There's no topper one. This one. That's not a real Oh my god, I thought that was a fake drawer. How long have you been here? I don't live here. What do you mean fake drawer? Why would that I have fake drawers in my kitchen? What do you mean fake? They look like they're drawers, but they don't open. They're just decorative. Hate doing this. He's having not, a terrible time. These aren't going to turn out good anyway. I'm going to throw them out. No one's going to eat them. Yeah. So just watch it and be quiet. Yeah. Why are you here? Watch Wait. Look. It's yeasting. Look. <laughs> Wait. Do you see it? Look at it growing. Ew. Isn't that weird? There's creatures. Yeah. It's activating. They're multiplying. Butter. How much? One fourth cup unsalted butter. 
One Soften to room temperature and cut into four pieces. Wow, that's very specific. Unsalted room temperature, four pieces. Unsalted room temperature, four pieces. Four, How much? Fourth of a cup. So one stick. One stick, unsalted, room temperature, four pieces. I'm going to look up some fun facts. About weevils? What are okay. five fun facts? Rubber bands last longer when refrigerated. That sounds fake, because then they would get tighter. I don't know, that's what it says. And then it would break. A shark is the only known fish that can blink with both eyes. How do we know? I don't know. That's what they say. Um, oh my god, wait, look, it's puffy now. It's like foamy. Look how foamy it is. Ew. I so. feel like I'm really the only one putting in the work here. Apparently Australia is wider than the moon. No way. Okay. But turn? 500 miles. Four pieces, just like God said. Just like God intended. The moon is only 2,000 miles across. Australia is 2,000 miles across? The moon is 2,159 miles. Isn't the U.S. like 2,000 miles across? Australia is definitely over 2,100. Like What's the size difference between Australia and the U.S.? Looks like the U.S. is a bit bigger, but they look they're about Oh, the yeah. Australia is small. Puny. And that's a bit wider than the moon somehow. I don't believe that, honestly. There's no way the moon is that small. Sorry, I don't believe it. Width of Aus Australian mainland extends for nearly 2,500 miles. Diameter of the moon, 2,100 miles. Let me see a picture of Australia and the moon side by side. How, how do I do that? Find it. Someone has to do it. If okay. they're making up these facts, I need to see it. This is like not giving bread, though. It's too creamy. Guys, check this out. It's wider than the moon. No, no lie. Eh, I don't know if I believe it. Anyone could bust forward or stop it. Yeah, I agree. Anyway. That looks gross. <laughs> it doesn't look <laughs> That like... doesn't look like bread. It looks like it could be. Looks runny. Can you give me a spatula? Oh. Spatula? You would. When you would ask that. Wait, why are two different utensils both called a spatula? What's the other spatula? The flat one that you would, like, flip pancakes with. Is this called a spatula? That's called a rubber spatula. Then what's the other one? But they're they're too different, I feel like. Look up some fun facts about Australia now. Yeah, Wait, did you read all five facts? I gave you three. Well, let's hear the rest. Does it have to be Australia? No, I want to hear the rest that were in that article. I thought you said there were five. Um, looks like there's a lot more than five. Oh, uh, well, I don't know. Find more Australia facts. Crocodile cannot stick its tongue out. That's kind of Australia. Dope. Uh, a shrimp's heart is in its head. Hmm. Is that Australia? Uh, wait, 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 wait. What? Do flamingos live in Australia? Because someone on the cake show earlier said that they were in Australia. They have not existed since the Ice Age. Flamingos haven't existed since the Ice Age? No, in Australia. I think this is too sticky. I think I need more flour. I said it should be a little sticky. But that part looks really sticky. Like, this is stickier than normal bread dough. I'm going to put a little bit more. Oh, it's like rubbery. Don't be doing funny business with the dough. You have your mic on? Oh. Best thing I can make it into the bowl? No, what if you drop it on the ground and then this was all for nothing? Okay, well, now all we do is wait for one to two hours, and the cookies wait one to two hours. There's so... more bread in there, too. Why? Because it's more bread. Why'd you only take half? Oh my god. It's like you just don't even like me. Why did you do that? Didn't do anything. Tom fooling with the bread. Looks pretty good to me. Oh, you don't even you. know the art of bread. I say it's your fault for not looking in the mixer. Well, you were holding a ball of bread. I assumed you had the bread. Well, there's a bad assumption. Great. One to two hours. Hopefully that's all the other bread, or are you hiding the rest somewhere that I should know about? No, well, that's it. Okay. Alright guys, we're back, and it's been many hours, or like it's a couple hours. It's been a little bit over one hour. <laughs> been like a few hours, whatever. But, bread is done. I'm go about to unravel it, and ho 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 ho. Oh my god, we have to let it rise for another hour after this. It's like over twice as much as before. It's okay, fast. so it said to punch it, and then shape it into balls. This dough that. is very, like, 
rubbery. It's very stretchy. We gotta put the balls in the pan. Okay, 14 to 16 smooth balls. That's probably too big, honestly. It is very rubbery. If it gets if it's too wrinkly, then it's not gonna be a smooth roll. See, like that is gonna go. So you gotta smush it together. You know, bread expert things. You wouldn't get it. I thought you would say I would get it. Ooh, I like doing this. That's, oh, that might be the thing to do. Like this. What? Found us ball technique? <laughs> My ball technique. Listen up, everyone. Okay. You can't even see. Hold on a second. The balls need to be front and center. The balls must be seen. As long as they're edible. Wait, no, actually, we have to have higher standards because this is our Thanksgiving roll. People are going to be eating these. Maybe I did put too much flour in. That extra flour may have been detrimental. Mm -mm -mm. I'm not feeling good about this. Why? What's not to be good feel about this? I don't feel like they're going to like start ripping apart and be all weird. Well, if they do, then we try our best. Yeah, but that, my best may not be good enough. This is important. This is Thanksgiving we're talking about. I kind of like doing this. Ugh. Oh my god. We're going to cover them. Let them rest. So they're going to grow. Yeah. Are they going to fit? Yeah. They're supposed to be voluptuous. Voluptuous balls. Who tried the lemon blackberry crumble? How was it? What did you yeah. say? Decadent. I'm going to try the apple pie. Chocolatillo decadence by design. I bet this one would have tasted really good when it was warm. And the um, way it's shaped like a little pie crust is so cute. You. Okay, gamers. It's been an incredibly long time. It is like like 10 something. It's almost 10. It could be 10. We've been here all day and we're tired and ready for bed, but... It's roll time. Before. They're ready. Before then, one last hoorah. The rolls don't look good. I'm gonna be honest. What are they supposed keep it real with you. What are they supposed to look like? Not that. <laughs> are they supposed to be combined? Yeah, that's not too much of a concern. I mean, they could be five more minutes, but... I feel like they need more, then maybe they'll look better. Well, we haven't ever done this before, right? I've made this recipe before. Oh. They are, they look pale, but they are crunchy on top. Well, we can do it again. <laughs> It's not like this is a one and only chance. I mean, Thanksgiving is this week. How many more times could we make rolls? Got like five days of roll time. Yeah, what am I going to do? Bake rolls every single day? <laughs> Who's going to eat all that? Hard knock rolls. We have some parsley haters in the house. Oh my god, I always forget to turn the oven off when I'm done cooking. And the other night I left a candle on all night long. And I always have been leaving the stove on lately. I'm just not with it. Nice hot butter. Just gonna kind of drizzle it over. Yeah. I guess you know what you're doing. Are you doing it on all of them? Yeah. Oh. What? You don't want butter on your roll? I mean, I think rolls have butter, whether you realize it or not. So you're gonna eat it, <coughs> and you're gonna like it. Humphrey Nichols here, everyone. Look at the sweet angel. He's out in the cold. Oh my god, he's so cute. Maybe I went overboard on the butter. <laughs> Little soggy. <laughs> well, here you go. I think I'm going to cook them a little bit longer. The butter made them extra soggy. They taste just like an Auntie Anne's pretzel.